everybody. We're doing a beat motion today, which means that we're going to keep a nice steady beat while we sing. We're singing a song we already know so that we can focus on the steady beat. We're going to sing, frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. How are we going to keep the beat to that? Well, I have a special percussion instrument called the gyro. It looks like a frog. <laughs> now, not all gyros look like frogs. I have a couple different ones that I'll show you in a little bit. But this special instrument called the gyro always has ridges. So if you look at the back of this little frog, you'll see he has ridges. And when I scrape the ridges, I have a little stick here, it makes this sound. Some people say that this sounds like a frog. <laughs> Does it sound like a frog to you? Listen. If I want to keep the steady beat, then I'll go ahead and scrape it over and over again without changing the rhythm so it's nice and steady. Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Pretty cool, right? I can go slower. Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. And I can go faster. Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. For this video, we're going to stay right in the middle, nice and steady. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Now this stick goes right in his mouth, and that's it. I want to show you what an actual real gyro looks like. I have the super gyro. Dun, da, da, dum. This is actually the gyro that you might you might see in a band, like a real band. It's really big. This one's extra big. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Do you see the ridges? And it comes with a stick. And you guessed it, I'm going to scrape the gyro. Now it even comes with two little... Um, uh, finger holes and some people say it looks like a little face <laughs> so I'm gonna put my fingers in here that's loud we're going to keep a nice steady beat while we sing here we go frog in the meadow can't get him out take a little stick and stir him about the super gyro I wonder if you can find something in your house, don't go yet, that has ridges that you can scrape. Now, I have a couple ideas here for you. If you have a notebook that has these rings on the side, you can take a pen and scrape those. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. And what about, I could use a fork with it. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Depending on what you use to scrape, it will sound different. What about a comb? You could use a comb and I'll use the end of my fork. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Maybe if I try a chopstick on the comb, it will be louder. Let's see. Kind of. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. I'll post a video in the next slide that shows you how to make your own gyro out of a water bottle, an empty water bottle. Most water bottles have ridges on the side that you can scrape. So that's a perfect way to make a gyro. And if you don't have a water bottle, try the things I just showed you. Keys have ridges. Frog in the meadow, 
dog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Keep practicing this song. You already know the song, but keep practicing the nice steady beat that goes with it. I'll see you next time. Bye. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about.